that took longer than expected. I really, I really don't have the eye, I think, for good thrifting. I really wish I did, but it's a practice and I don't have it yet. But what I did get were these leggings, which I actually already own in full length, and these are cropped. And they were $3, which is why I got them. So not quite the indie trendy vibe that I kind of thought that I could have, but I will wear them. And then I also got two dollar wine glasses because I turned 21 in a month. And so I figure maybe I'll need them. But that was it. My total was $5. It was pretty slow checking out and I was just watching. Where did I put my keys? Oh, they're in the ignition. I was just watching the sunset as I was sitting there. But I think if I hurry, I can still catch it. I pulled into an abandoned parking lot that I thought would be empty to look at the sunset and three cars pulled in after me. And so, I felt a little awkward, as maybe you could see. So we'll just enjoy the sunset from the windshield. If we get there fast enough, I know another spot that could be really good to watch the sunset, but there's traffic, and that's a little out of my control. So I'm kind of just watching it slip under. I think we're making it in time. I say that's pretty well worth it. Hello! Instead of going to the bathroom, we're just eating mulch. Yum yum. I went to bed later than I wanted to last night, but I still set my alarm for seven because the winter solstice was yesterday, which means we get a couple more minutes of sunlight each day and I want to be around for them. I'm tired. of a skin time where putting only concealer on to cover the redness essentially just turns into putting concealer over my whole face but sometimes that happens i like how long this mascara makes eyelashes look i make coffee every morning using a french press and I just saw a TikTok that was showing how to properly use a French press, and I think I really have been selling myself short. So I've already had one cup today, and I'm gonna make another with the excuse of using the tips that I saw. The water is 200 degrees. I'm gonna pour a little bit in first and let the coffee bloom. I don't know what that means, but someone said it. I don't know how long it's supposed to bloom for, but I'll pour the rest in. And then I saw you're not supposed to stir with metal, which I have done every day that I've done this, because something about it messes with the acidity of the coffee. So I'm using our potato-based fork. <laughs> okay. Would that be true of regular coffee in a spoon too? No idea. And then you're supposed to set this right over the foam and let it sit there for a while. Where did you usually sit it? I just had it open. <laughs> okay, it sat for maybe two minutes. Don't know if that's long enough. Oh. 
My French press always leaks out the back. Do you see that happen? I don't know how to fix it. Okay, it's still gonna be hot, but. I think that's better. This is a good cup of coffee. Some fresh laundry to work out in. Fuel. Got my trusty ASIC gel Nimbus and getting ready to do a Sydney Cummings workout. It's basically all I ever do anymore. dentist appointment that I severely overestimated how long it would take me to get here and I haven't been here since since the spicy flu ravaged the earth so I don't know if they have like policies about going in early or not so I think I'll just sit until my time it really is a beautiful day it's about 59 degrees just wait until you see these pearly whites Got that good brush technique. I just remembered as I was getting into my car that my key fob has been out of battery for a while. So I might go to O'Reilly's too if I'm feeling a little wild. Oh, okay. You can grab this without going to key fob. Uh, yes, we do. Do you know what, what kind of battery you need? Nope. <laughs> I'm learning more about my car. I'm more self sufficient rather than having to do a fob before. Uh, perfect. And it cuts out a bit more. <laughs> Absolutely incredible, groundbreaking, earth shattering. Anytime I need anything, they come in clutch. So a haul, I got a new battery for my fob, which a fob not working is not the end of the world at all, but it really is just a minor inconvenience that happens a lot during the day. So I'm glad to get that taken care of. what goodies came in the mail. Oh no. My sister got a ticket. <gasps> New photos from Compassion. Nice. 